Uh, it's a um, Block Talk Radio show uh, where I discuss various topics. And uh, tonight we're talking about uh, do we need marriage? Okay, what's so funny? Uh, a lot of things are funny. Um, um, I was just talking about a uh, guy who had sex with a dolphin about two weeks ago, and uh, some other crazy stuff. But let, let me ask you this question. Did you hear about a female who who's um trying to move to New Jersey just so she can marry her dad, her father, her biological father? Did you hear about that? No, I haven't heard that one. No, I didn't okay. hear that one. No, I didn't hear that one. Well, what do you think about that? I think the two people got to be sick if they're serious. Uh, uh, yeah, they're very serious, actually. Uh, do you find that worse? Do you find that to be different um, than a homosexual marriage? It's different than a homosexual marriage, but it's incest is what it is. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah, I agree with it. But well, how do you feel? Well, let me ask you a question. What does marriage mean to you in 2015? Two people totally committed, totally committed to one another, one that, another are up, that are building up of each other. All right, that's definitely like a good definition. In every way. Yes. Now, who should be allowed to marry each other? Who should be allowed to marry each other? Two people in love. Yeah. That well, love what about that? That are in love. Well, what about that father and daughter? I think they're in love, from what I read in the article. Mm, no, that's that ain't that ain't the kind of love between a man and a woman. That's that's that's, that's sick. I'm sorry, I, well, I, I don't agree really with that. I think that's sick. All right. Well, what about homosexual marriage? Do you, you think that's cool? No, I don't agree with that. What it about says, uh, um, Eve and um, Adam and Eve, not Adam and Eve. So, no, I don't agree with that. that came out. Well, what about uh, Adam and a dolphin? Is, is that okay? What? What? Uh, there. Well, there are people who have like. Well, they're not official or anything, but you know, have you ever heard of a person marrying a dolphin before? No. No. Well, 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 the guy from two weeks ago, he didn't marry a dolphin. He just screwed the dolphin. But, uh, you see, this is the person to be no, allowed I to marry No, I never heard of people marrying animals. Marry animals. Well, should they be allowed to? No, no, that's, no, no, that's, 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 and have sex with animals. Not marry no animals. Not marry no animals. Okay. Well, uh, do you do you feel that marriage um in 2015 is religious? Is what? Like religious as in G- Do you believe marriage is just as religious as it was when Jesus lived? Or is that who had lived? No, 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 no. It ain't even what it was okay. three years ago. Is that right? No, I don't believe so. Well, do you think uh, the way marriages work should um, change at all? Well, I think it's uh, men marrying men and women marrying women should stop for sure. Because it's not, not, you know, um, it, to me it ain't natural, but it ain't that's natural, just my opinion. That's just my opinion. Not natural. Okay. No. All right. No. All right. All right. You, you say that should change. Uh, so it's not as religious as it used to be, but people still shouldn't be like allowed to do what they couldn't do, like throwing Jesus aside. Oh, uh, what about what about divorce uh, laws? Do you think that works? Like, uh, I think if uh, Kobe Bryant's wife had divorced him, she would have got about two hundred million dollars. Some people say that's not fair. Do you think that's fair? Well, I don't, I don't, I don't know about two hundred million dollars. He got a lot of money, but 
I don't know. I don't know. It's a club in the circumstances. Well, you know of circumstances with, with Kobe Bryant and his wife, and that's the right. I think that's her name. Isn't that the right? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Okay. I don't think she should have died that much, but, that much, but um, whatever they accumulated um, by, it was married, I believe she should have been entitled to her. She been entitled to her. But, but she hasn't made a layup in her life, though. <laughs> I mean, come on. I'm I'm just saying that's what the law says. The man tried to have a for what they had. Not when they came in the marriage, because whatever he had when he got married, he got married. but whenever they came in, while they was married, they, that's a shit thing. Hey, uh, do you do you, rem- do you, do you do realize that at one point in time, uh, the law said it was okay for people to own other people? You, you do realize that, right? No. Uh, you, you don't realize that, that the law once said that uh, it, was, it was okay for people to own other people as slaves. Oh, yes, yes, I do oh, remember yes, that. Yeah, remember years, that. Ago. Yes, years ago. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, did, did you think the law was okay then? No. No. Okay. <laughs> but the case with, uh, with uh, um, divorce laws and things like that, you said the law says that says says this, but do you think it's okay that the law says that? Well, I don't know. The law, 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 the I guess ten percent of his money she can live off. Yeah, ten percent would have been enough. She didn't, she didn't even need ten percent, trust me. <laughs> because she, she can live off of ten percent too. Okay, all right. Now, what do you think about men that refuse to get married? Um, I want to say someone I'm cowards. Say someone cowards. To be with a woman for a long, long time, like some people be together for thirty years and never get married. And if you've been with somebody for five years and never, never marriage never come up, then it means they ain't gonna marry you. Yeah, but you, or you said men who refuse like that, who who, who don't do that, are they're cowards. That that stay with a woman for thirty years, they're cowards. Why do, why do you feel that's a coward? Because, um, I mean, why just live with a woman? What's wrong with giving a woman your name? What's wrong with making living a life together? Wait, wait, but you can make a life without him, without getting married, can't you? Yeah, you can, but I wouldn't. Well, if that's a good if somebody is really living a life for God and if somebody just living. Now the person that's religious or trying to live their life for God, they don't want to be married. They don't want to be in a relationship for X amount of years and they end up marrying them. For somebody that's not religious and they just live their life, they might not never care. But then you got some people that they ain't religious at all, but they still want to be married. So. Well, how do you feel about atheists getting married? Do you think that's uh, odd? Atheists in marriage. I, I don't, I don't know. I just, I don't, I don't see nothing wrong with an atheist getting married. I mean, they, they still want to get married. Marriage is a commitment between two people that they, I'm exclusive to you, you're exclusive to mine, and we want to build a life together. We want to uplift each other in every way possible. We might possibly want to have a family. That's what marriage is about, okay. But what about people that have families without marriage, though? Is that a bad thing? Um, um, I don't think it has to be a bad thing. It's according to, you know, people, you know, people's opinions. Some people don't need to get married. Once they get married, it seems like everything goes haywire. They get along fine. Once they get the, get the marriage certificate, they marry for a while, then everything fall apart. 
Yeah, I've heard of such things. Um, Excuse me? Taking back to one of the, yeah, I've heard of 